Hi guys, Snake Dodder here, Dr. Creeper is with me. It is time for Loot Crate, let's unbox this. We're back on the main channel. Um, I've decided, decided to, what? What? So what's the squeak for? I didn't. Tell him what you're doing. I was putting my arm on here and it made a squeaky de -weak. squeak. Yeah, we're back on the main channel and um, we're gonna be doing the unboxings back on the main channel. I think it's fairer to the companies that I buy the, the boxes from. It gets more exposure. We're gonna keep the main channel for vlogging at conventions and stuffs and when we get when we get puppy, when we get puppy we'll be able to go out on dog vlogs, more dog vlogs. But um yeah, let's have a look. Let's open up loot crate and let's see what we get in the January box. So the first item in the loot crate box for January, as always, is a loot crate magazine. This has been It's a booklet. It is a booklet. It's a bit thicker than normal. I think they've 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 kind of They've tweaked, they've made more stuff, um, more content in the magazines, a lot more about each individual item and about the themes in the items. Um, so yeah, it's, it's a good stuff. I'm not gonna go through it obviously because it's gonna show some of the items, but there's a quick flick. There you go, spoilers. Woo. First item, it's an elastic band. I... Out the window! <laughs> it actually went out the window. Well, well, we're never gonna know what that's for. Um, it's an elastic band, but it's gone. It's gone, let's have a look at the next proper item. So, the first thing in this box, other than that weird outdoor elastic band, is... What are you doing? What's that crash? Is um, a brand new loot pin, as it says on the back, on the little packaging there. A loot pin. Gone are the loot crate, loot crate badges. <coughs> and in, in its place we have a January 2016 loot pin. Hashtag loot pin. January 2016 invasion, as it says there. And on the back it says this pin unlocks something epic and it says go to lootcrate.com forward slash pin so i don't know if you need the pin to do that pin. have a look it says on the back there um yeah that's a lovely design it's all kind of shaped as well so i'm wondering whether each one's going to be different this has the invasion sort of style graphic on it i'm trying to show you without it shining um, but it's pretty awesome definitely going to keep all of these we had all the other ones i've kind of given all my loot crate and all my unboxing stuff away i do it at conventions every so often i'll collect them all up um, and give them away so look out at coming in um, conventions in the UK I don't take them to Ireland to my shows in Ireland because obviously it cost me too much money to bring them but um, yeah if you if you come to an event that I'm at in England I will probably have some form of loot on me so um, yeah I'm, but I'm going to keep these I'm going to try and get all the loot pins that I get all of these I'm going to keep and um, yeah that's a really cool one let's have a look at the next actual proper first item thing in the box I'm a winner Woo! this is a, a replica multi-pass from the film with Bruce Willis and someone Bruce. someone else as well. I can't remember who it was. But um, yeah, Bruce Willis was in it anyway. And it's called The Fifth Element. Um, and this was like, you, you won. Element. Yeah. You won a, 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 a pass, a flight, a special flight um, to, to Floston Paradise. <laughs> Floston. Um, and yeah, it was, it was a cool film. If you haven't seen it, check it out. It's a bit weird. It's a bit weird at times, but it's a good film. And this is a proper movie prop, and it is a Loot Crate exclusive, as it says there on the cardboard topper. Awesome. Topper. Next, we have some limited edition exclusive Loot Crate Invasion of the Mini Prints. They're little cards. I'm going to open them up. I just had a quick look before I started this link. We have two cards. We have a War of the Worlds one, which is pretty awesome. An old film, if you haven't seen it. War of the Worlds is a good film. Oh. We also have The Day the Earth Stood Still, another classic. These are actually really nice, and I may, may I if like I that can. One the best. Yeah, the Earth Daily Earth is still a cool film as well. It's again both very old. War of the Worlds was remade with um, Tom Cruise um, a few years ago, but um, yeah, that's the original. And it'd be cool to get some kind of frame for these and put them up because that actually would be quite cool. I quite like them. They're good. Rummy. Awesome. Do 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 do. I can't do the real music because it's copyright and obviously my recreation of it, recreation, can't it's speak, would be wrong. so good that it would get a copyright strike. So there you go. It's an LED flashlight from the X-Files. If you don't know what the X-Files is, it's an old kind of 90s um, TV series, all sort of aliens and stuff. Um, it was really good and they're remaking it. They're remaking a new series of it. This is water resistant, anti-shock, and it's got batteries included which yes. are packaged and, separately. They're there. And I just broke it. But. I just broke them and it's a Loot Crate exclusive as it says at the bottom there. I'm not going to get it out because it's in one of those weird sealed package things but you know what a torch the does. horrible packages. Yeah. They're it's horrible. A, it's an LED torch and it's pretty awesome. I and love batteries. And there goes the tram train. Batteries are awesome. You've seen a battery before. Yes. Yeah, I love the X-Files. GP, extra heavy duty, four tight pulses. In case you wanted to know what the battery was. X-Files, LED torch. Love it. The next item is another Loot Crate exclusive, as it says there, look. 
Um, I don't know if the camera's even focusing. You have to excuse my, my noobishness with this new camera. This is the first film, my no. first thing I've done with my new camera, my new camcorder. Jamie uh, bought his camera call, camcorder for the last few unboxings I've done, I'm and you guys, I'm just a pro, you are a pro, but you guys said that you like the quality, you like the angle, like the position that it's always been recorded in. So I got my own one. And, and I trade I traded in my, my whole life's technology stuff mm -hmm. and upgraded and got this camera. And um, yeah, this is awesome. But this is this is a space invader. It is a it's a mini alien vinyl figure. I'm gonna I'm gonna take it out of the box. Woo! Boxes. Um, we need to we need to see. There we go. It doesn't very noisy. Doesn't do anything. It literally is a plastic toy. A plastic space invader. But I like that. I'm retro. I'm old. You may not have noticed that I'm old because I do obviously disguise it with my young, young boyish good looks. But I am quite old. Huh? What? Um, but yeah, that is a Space Invader, one of the first games I played when I was little. Um, and uh, yeah, All that's really cool. Ago. All those centuries. <laughs> Get out. Go on. Go on. Goodbye. Stay out. Okay. Go on. Bye. <laughs> Space Invader. That's really cool. Hello! I'm a face hugger! If you haven't seen this, this is awesome. This is from the film Alien. Um, Aliens, Alien 2, Aliens is my favourite film of all time. I love that film. And this is from Alien. This was when the monster goes and comes out of a person's body. And you get face hug. Get out! Go away! Just shoot! You get, you get the little face. He's a little cute face hugger though. You can't be mad at this little gorgeous thing. That I love. A little face hugger plushie. Um, I, it is another Loot Crate exclusive. I'm not sure if they're going for exclusives on every item now. I'm really not sure. But um, that I love. I absolutely love that. That is going to go pride of place up on my shelf. But behind me, um, a little Loot Crate exclusive alien facehugger. Fantastic. Let's have a look at the last item. So, the last item, as modelled by my freshly allowed, back in the room, able assistant. He is wearing the exclusive Loot Crate t-shirt for this month. Do you want to stand still and actually show people this? is an X-Files t-shirt. I love it. It's black, which isn't my favorite color. As you guys know, if you watch all my unboxing, you know I don't really wear black t-shirts, but I love the X-Files, and I think this would probably be something I do wear. So um, check out future unboxings, or maybe you'll catch a glimpse of me in a, in a, in a, maybe in a web in a webcam or on a live stream or on something, you might catch me um, wearing this t-shirt. I really like that, it's cool. And uh, yeah, that is it. That is the last item in this month's Loot Crate. So there you go guys, that is the January box from Loot Crate, a really cool box, some really good exclusive stuff in there, I love, I love the face hugger, he is so cute, look at him, his little happy face, <laughs> yeah you can you can keep it on your face for the end, you could be face hugged, that is the end of the box, like I said, some really cool stuff, if you want to get your own Loot Crate, follow the links on screen or in the description, you'll get um, a bit of a saving if you use my code, and it helps me out as well, which is really lovely, so yeah, from me and Dr Creeper, if he's alive for the next unboxing, we'll see you again very soon. Cheers, bye! bye.